Welcome back, my name is Alex Bartholomew today, and today we're talking about how I hate airports. Yeah, so pretty much where I went down to Miami, for you know, like, I just got back today actually. I was there all week this week, and I hate airports in general, bro. Because airports, it's honestly very annoying when it comes to security. Security is very, very annoying, bro. I remember at a flight, technically it was 6.30, but I had to be there by 6 o'clock for the boarding. And so I get there at 5.15, right? Because I was in there 15 minutes early, I couldn't check in my bags, and I had to wait three hours for another one. And honestly, that makes me so upset. It's like, what is the point of that, bro? If the plane doesn't take off until, well, technically, if, if, it, if the board isn't close until 6, we actually don't fly until 6.30. Why do I got to check in an hour early? It doesn't make sense to me, but I guess how, <laughs> that's how it is. I seen this one guy, right? He 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 spent. He was talking about he spent five hundred dollars on a plane ticket. He's actually he's actually ten minutes late compared to me. And he was cussing at the the, <laughs> the service lady so bad. I mean, it wasn't her fault, but he was mad. He was mad. He was like, "Bro, I'm literally ten minutes." Late. He was like, "I spent five hundred dollars on this on this effing plane ticket, bro. Y'all gonna let me go? I'm not gonna go another day. I need to go today. I need to go today." And they're like, "Sorry, sir. Don't make us get security for you." I'm like, "Bro." It was me. Go get security, bro. We shut this bitch down right now. <laughs> and <laughs> that's like the worst thing about it, bro. Like they had to get security for him because he would not leave. And my thing too, one thing I like about the airports is the food itself is expensive for no reason. Like I got me a, a steak, egg and cheese. I remember exactly something like that. Like orange juice, right? In total, that was like a forty forty dollar like it's forty dollars in total, right? The orange juice itself was like this big, bro. This big, plus eight dollars. Eight dollars for the for the orange juice. Orange juice like this big, bro. Eight dollars, bro. I'm like, do you need a strong sir? I can just. It's a shot glass for me, bro. The, like, what is this, bro? No. Like, it's it's expensive for no reason, bro. And sparkling water was like sixteen dollars. Sparkling water, sixteen dollars. A bottle of water was eight dollars. Overpriced for absolutely no reason, bro. Every food should never be that overpriced, bro. I recommend if you're going to the airport, bro, please, 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 for sure, eat before you get there. Do not buy stuff on the plane either because they're overpriced for absolutely no reason. I remember on the plane, they were trying to sell literally a Lunchable. They call it a snack box, but in reality, it's just a Lunchable for like adults for nine bucks. The same thing I want would cost you like $2. Overpricing for a reason? I have no idea, bro. Because we're, we're living in a high class, you know what I mean? We're flying. No, bro. It's just expensive for absolutely no reason, bro. I had this one lady sitting next to me. She seen the price of the item. She got immediately. She's like, fuck that. I'm not doing it. I walk her right out. She's like, I ain't gonna do this. I ain't paying for this food. And like, <laughs> it was a funny thing, bro, because I had never seen people like, bro, like, I have airplane food before, like before. But it's always surprising when you see the price savings compare it if you're just buying it normally on the street somewhere. And my second thing, why I don't like about airports, is the fact that people feel entitled from first class into coach. No matter what, I'm always gonna ride coach. I don't ever think it's a point to ride first class because first class really the only difference between first class and like regular. It, it depends where you're going actually. It depends where you're going. Sometimes it depends where you're going. As a country, first class is probably the best way to go out. But like anyone else, like if you're traveling between the United States, coach. First class, really just curtains. They get to go. They get to leave first in the plane. They, they get to come in first. That's that's what it is. And they get they get some exclusive food. That's it, bro. We're all going the same way. The difference is I spend a hundred, you spend five hundred dollars, and I'm four hundred dollars richer. You know what I mean? But like I just first class is just a waste. When I was in Florida, I went down to Miami, you know, visit some family members. That was pretty cool. Um, really hang out with my family most of the time. Didn't do anything too crazy. I didn't really have anything planned to do in Florida. I just had to go there for some family emergency and took care of that. My biggest thing when it comes to airports and like airplanes in general is to take off. Because you literally go from zero to like 300 miles an hour within like a second. into the air right and you know when like when you look outside the window it goes slowly up 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 up, up. and you notice like things get smaller and smaller and smaller until you're just surrounded by clouds the entire time it 
it's a beautiful experience, but also a scary experience because my thing's like, remember, my, my head runs like, if I fall right now, that is a really big fall. 10,000, 3,000, no, 30,000 feet in the air. So like, when I'm in, when I'm in an airplane, bro, I gotta have headphones in or I gotta fall asleep. Because if I'm awake the entire time, I'm freaking out the entire time. Dude, I can't do that, bro. I can't do that to myself. But honestly, but thank you for watching. My name is Alex Park I hope you enjoyed this video. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and follow. Subscribe and follow is the same thing. Follow, follow my other social media accounts, actually. Appreciate you for watching the video today. I'm out.